Developers in America are systematically and wantonly destroying the graves of former slaves and freedmen, despite the fact that they are supposedly protected by law. Not only that, but the same cannot be said of white historic graves, of which great lengths are taken to ensure their respectful treatment and relocation. Take the case in Virginia, where a historic black cemetery was destroyed to make way for Microsoft's expansion of an existing data center. The graves largely consisted of members of the Mosley family, with one stone giving the date of 1930, though the graveyard was in use for at least 100 years before that. The Mosley family still lived in the area and were prominent and well known. Nobody reached out to them about their relatives' remains, and an archaeological survey done that suggested the gravesite should be given protected status was later revised due to pressure from developers. The remains were moved in the most disrespectful way possible, with a digger in rain-soaked weather, meaning the majority of the bodies were damaged on disinterment, the surviving headstones were moved, and all of the other bones of the 30-plus former slaves and freedmen were buried in a mass grave. To add insult to injury, the family was not informed that their relatives had been moved. 